take it. And second thing is, IDE tool. IDE tool means nothing but a integrated development environment tool. So IDE uh, abbreviates the integrated development environment. Which ID tool is uh, preferred means so you can say Eclipse IDE. IDE version. I am asking that IDE version. Version is I am saying that. version or we can say id edition so edition i can say enterprise edition by enterprise edition means by enterprise edition Why interface edition means because web application testing purpose. So we all are know Java interface edition is developing web application. So IDE Eclipse IDE we required that IDE edition is interface edition. Eclipse Eclipse downloads. What is that link? Eclipse downloads. Here I am seeing that Eclipse downloads the Eclipse Foundation. Click on that Eclipse downloads Eclipse Foundation. Here I am seeing that this is the download link. Go through the go through this download x86 underscore 64 link. And Here we are seeing that. Okay, this is the download link. Before that, we need to give that allow cookies. Now click on the download link. Let us see. Here the Eclipse IDE was downloading. It will be in around uh, one to two minutes based on your internet connection. Here it will downloading uh, around 20 seconds I think. Now we are successfully downloaded. Download is different. Install is different. Now we are downloaded this Eclipse.exe file. And after successfully completion of your download. Successfully completion of your download. Now let us see in the in the left side down like bottom corner we are seeing that this option like open option which option it is open or else you can go through the downloads also it should be available now here i am clicking on the open clicking on the open now just wait a two seconds it should be open Now Eclipse installer will be following. Okay. Here we have a Eclipse IDE for Java developers, Eclipse IDE for interface Java and web application development. For Java projects, Eclipse IDE for Java developers is enough. But we are going through the web application testing. Which application testing it is? Web application testing. To do this web, web application testing purpose, we need to go through the enterprise edition. We already know 
core for core java purpose we are downloading the standard edition for our, like uh, for web application development they are started interface edition for mobile application we are going through the micro edition for web application purpose here i am clicking on the second which is the second options it is nothing but a eclipse ide for enterprise java and web developers i am clicking on that eclipse ide for web applications now here i am seeing that option like install option when i am clicking this install it should show some agreement okay i have some some xyz you can accept my conditions terms and conditions we need to say accept now now it will be taking around some laptops it will taking 5 minutes some systems it will taking 15 minutes some systems it will taking 30 minutes based on your internet connection be in patience No. Here, this is the main thing: creating of workspace. Workspace is nothing but a whatever we are writing programs in Eclipse IDE. It should be stored in separate folder. So we need to create our own workspace. Defaultly, it will under in our computer C drive and users and username and Eclipse workspace. This is the folder. We need to create our own workspace. So click on the browse. click on the browse it should be navigating to the files it should be navigated to your files in that files just observe here here i am going through a driver i am going approaching here here i have a google like a g drive uh, must you need to prefer e drive or d drive like in your systems you are following some e drives and d drives you need follow e or d or f drive. here i am approaching that g drive here i am creating one new folder new folder new folder the folder name is sorry uh, there is a not enough space okay to the c only i am creating one new folder but guys you need to follow create a new folder in g drive or sorry uh, d drive or f drive okay here i am going through the new folder the folder name is for underscore automation i created a one folder the folder name is for automation and i am selecting this for automation folder and select folder now let us see workspace is c drive for automation the workspace is c drive for automation and i am going through the launch and i am going through the launch now i successfully created one workspace and successfully i installed eclipse now i am going to write a one program in eclipse id here it was loading here i am going through the open this is the welcome board this is the welcome board who are entering the file? okay uh, here having some tutorials and here having some samples here having some overview but we don't need this type of welcome board let us like uh, we will discuss in the direct way in your tutorials now here i am closing this welcome here i am closing this welcome now 
here defaultly it will have in a create a maven project it will de default having in a create a maven project first initially in practice purpose don't go through with the maven projects we need to work on the java projects when we are going through the practice like eppudaithe mana practice chestamo mana first java projects meeda cheskovalam so here here is my cursor i am going through the open perspective this is the option like open perspective i click on on the open perspective here i am seeing the java here java is the one of the option we found just go through the double click now it was started the create a java project option now here we have that uh, here we have that java this is the java w we we created the now we need to create a java project here for selenium purpose file a new like file and new my project name is here we need to give some project name is my selenium first project okay and must and should i am I, like i am remembering this thing we need to uncheck the module we need to uncheck the module like where, with the module we can't able to create a project and after that go to the option like finish project option and after the completion and share the to create this project and build okay and after the creation of project default it will comes with the java run environment that is nothing but a what are the java predefined packages we have that should be default it should be available in a jre system libraries now to the src to the src src is nothing but a source src is nothing but a source to the source we need to create a first package we can't create a package default it should be create one package now, src right click to the src and we are seeing the new option to the new option we have a package option src to the new we have a package guy uh, okay guys see one second uh, like this is the concept first we need to go through the src new and then package click on the package we must and should we need to follow package name as com dot qa this is commonly we are practicing the uh, like uh, practicing the qa session com dot qa is a common thing just go through the com dot qa dot here i am going through the um, package name is hello package okay just i am going through the com dot qa dot hello just i am going through the finish here i am going through the finish to the package to the package i am creating the class now, right click and new here is the class option click on the class to the class i am giving a name as class name is hello guys must and should class name should be start with the capital letter don't start with the numerical and don't go through the spaces in between the class or else we can go through the underscore uh, the and iphone is bit and i'm going through the public static void main string also for defaultly generating the main method i click on the public static void main string also and i'm going through the finish option now yeah this is our class environment
yeah okay guys now to the main method to the main method we are going through the printing statement which statement it is printing statement that is available in java yes by system dot out dot print to the eclipse we need to go through the sysvo sysvo and control press on the control and click on the space bar click on the space bar just we can create in this system dot out dot print ln option in this statement in the double quotes we are following the hello selenium this is the word hello selenium then like uh, like that in java we are starting the hello world program like that we are starting here hello selenium program and go through the control yes control yes for saving purpose control yes and after that here we are seeing one option here we are seeing some option then click on the this button then we can see in the console we can see the answers let us see here hello selenium it was printed that hello selenium this is the first selenium project just based on the java we are created a first selenium project and the class name is hello selenium and we are printed that hello selenium 